I'm Clint Winkler, a junior from uh, Newell, and my events are the two mile, mile, and 800. I'm shooting to go to state in both of the long distance events. Gonna try get some PRs, get, try run under 11 in the two mile and under five in the mile. There have been big improvements every year, kind of at least 30 seconds on the mile every year, so I'm, I should be running under five this year, so should get some good PRs. Hi, my name is Rachel Irk, and I'm a senior at Newell High School. This year I plan to run the one, two, four, and long jump. I've made it in long jump the last four years, and I've made it in the 200 also the last four years. And I plan to do the exact same thing as last year, make it in the one, two, four, and long jump. Hi, I'm Sarah Irk. I do the triple high jump sprints, and this year I want to go for javelin too. Uh, the last two years, I made it to stay in high jump place my first year at sixth, and then this last year I didn't make opening height, so I stayed in place. But in triple jump, I qualified my second year and didn't do so hot, but it was fun and I would love to go again. Gators on three. One, two, two three, Gators. <laughs> we are at Austin Auditorium in Newell visiting with Kara Muckridge about the track and field season coming up. Glad to visit with you again. Yeah, thanks for coming. Uh, you're looking forward to a good year this year? Yes, I think it's going to be a great year. Um, we have a f the kids that we do have in our high school team are all returners, so it's a, it's a good program to keep building. Um, we have a little bit smaller numbers, as I think we have 12, um, but five of our kiddos that went to state, um, four of them are coming back. So we have a lot of state returners, and we have a lot of uh, upperclassmen that are going to do some good things this year. So our senior, our returning senior, uh, Rachel Irk, is um, actually going to Mount Marty this next school year for track and field. Um, she'll be doing her same long jump, high jump, or not high jump, uh, one, two, and four. Um, so we're going to hopefully see some good things out of her again this year. We have Clint Winkler returning. Um, I think he's, he's our long distance guru, and he'll... He'll do some good things in the one mile, two mile, and just anything we put him into. Um, we got Sarah Irk last year. Um, she was suffering from some hip injuries, um, so hopefully we get her for the good solid year. Um, and she'll be doing triple jump, high jump, um, 100, 200, kind of she's kind of whatever running we want to put her in. Um, who else do we have? We have Mesa Mangus. She'll be coming up. She's an eighth grader this year, but she'll be coming up to high school and she was one of our girls that went in 300 hurdles last year just kind of came out of the blue and brought her up to high school and she qualified the first time she ran them so um, we're going to see some good things out of her um, we have just a few returning distance runners um, we got uh, David Kirby we have uh, three of the Bender kids Erilyn, um, Autumn and Orrin all coming back and uh, B.J. Tesh will be back as a high jumper. Uh, she went to state last year as well, and so we'll hope to see some good things out of her. Of course, Coach, the challenge is your conference. It's a good conference. Yes, uh, Timberlake is always a tough school to come up against. Um, um, Harding County always has a good conference team, um, and we're lower in numbers, but we still have a lot of our athletes, so I think we'll put up a good fight, and we'll see how we come out. Um, yeah. Lots of good events coming up, uh, and you get started. Uh, is it April 5th in Spearfish? Yep, April 5th is our first one in Spearfish. That's always a good one to get a lot of the, the jitters out, and it's always good athletes to um, see where everybody's at right away in the year. All right, Coach, good luck this year. Thank you very much.